Hi guys, Claire here again, Red Deer Public Library's Young Adult Services Coordinator, and today is our final DIY project. So it is a wall hanger, which I will be using as a jewelry holder, but you can use to hold whatever you like. So let's get started with our final project. I hope you had a great summer with uh, the Teen Summer Reading Club, and I hope you continue to send me pictures of all of the things that you're making this summer. So see you soon, and let's get right into this project. So for this project, you'll need two sticks of either equal or unequal length, some fake foliage, you can get this stuff at the dollar store if you don't have any at home, some type of string or yarn, a hot glue, and some hot glue sticks, a spray paint of your choice, I'm going with copper, a pair of scissors, a few small nails, and a hammer. So let's go ahead and get started. So your first step is going to be wanting to roughly figure out where you want your foliage to be in relation to your sticks. So you probably want a larger space in here for when we're going to add the nails for us to be able to hang things from it. Um, so a nice open space is what I would recommend. So let's go ahead and glue these down. So now that we've glued our flowers down, we're going to take it outside to be spray painted. You want to remember to uh, do some light coats and do it in a well ventilated area. And so we'll come back when it's all dry. So as you can see, our spray painting is complete, and now we'll be adding our nails. I've chosen to do three nails along the bottom and four along the top, because I just feel like that's what I have space for. So let's go ahead and nail. Now we're going to get our string, our yarn, our twine, whatever we're using to attach the bottom to the top piece and then also to add a piece to hang it from. So let's go ahead and do that. So now that we've added our string, we're going to take a photo so that you can see the final product. <laughs> 